Hey everyone, Goldie here. I have been using a super fun feature and it's actually called Skype for Content Creators. I created a video using this feature with Rachel and Felpina. The best part is that you can live stream or record and upload onto platforms such as Facebook, LinkedIn, or YouTube. Now it's a few easy steps that I'll take you through right now. You'll want to make sure that you download the latest version of Skype for Mac or PC. Now you'll want to pick your favorite live streaming or recording app. I'm using XSplit. However, you can use any NDI enabled hardware or software such as New Tech TriCaster, OBS, Wirecast, Ecamm Live. Here's how to turn on the Skype for Content Creators feature. Number one, click your profile icon. Number two, scroll down to settings. Number three, select calling. Number four, select advanced. Number five, turn NDI on. Now start a video call in Skype. Now go back to XSplit. Select add source. Select streams. In this case, I'll select new tech NDI. Now you can select individual feeds as an NDI source. So now you see how you can send your Skype calls directly to your NDI enabled software or hardware. So here's my video that's been recorded and edited for uploading to YouTube or LinkedIn. I could have also live streamed this content directly to Facebook or Twitch. So I wanted to tell you guys about this show that I got asked to pitch. Little Goldie's floating, <laughs> like on your, on your shoulder. I think we can, like I think we can make that happen. I can't help it. Hashtag Daily Goldie. Um, so let's do some sample editing. This is a single stream that I've dropped into my editing software. You can resize a solo stream from small to large, to any size in between. You can also drag the stream and place it anywhere you like. So now that you have this one stream, you can add in more than one stream to your edited video. For example, this is me in Los Angeles, this is Palpina in Amsterdam, and this is Rachel in Dallas. Now this is two streams at the same time, and now this is three streams. Once again, you can resize the individual streams any way you like. So you can focus on the person talking or a reaction shot or additional B-roll footage. Okay, let's now put all three streams onto the screen. We can place all of them to one side to allow for a graphic or still image. We can also put them in a row at the top of the screen or the bottom of the screen to allow for a lower third or upper third or ticker. We can also add in a fun logo. This is my signature green heart logo. Skype for Content Creators is available for Mac and PC. Get the latest version 